Plum Kettle is such a great character, and the show's so very deeply told from her point of view. Her eyes are our window into this world. Plum's idea of fitting into the world is rendering herself invisible. There's no place for her, so she's going to hide away. Everything is potential for humiliation and mockery. She's dressed all in black, nothing too tight, nothing too flashy, because who wants to be noticed and laughed at? She just wants to get through until she can transform into something acceptable. Surgery is the only answer. She works as a ghostwriter for a teen magazine, and she is affecting lives, but it has to be behind this veil, writing for Kitty. Kitty Montgomery is a fiery redhead. She's brought a girl's magazine named Daisy Chain up through the ranks, and it's now the number one magazine. She's over the top all the time. She's incredibly dramatic, and she's always right. Around here, you start looking like somebody's grandmother, you're out. Martha Stewart can get away with it. She sells hot glue guns, but tastemakers? No. She has no filter, and she doesn't feel like she has to have a filter. Like, that's her brand. The beauty closet. Go. They have answers. Julia is the doyen of the beauty closet, which is the uh, sub-basement of Austin Media, where all the latest and greatest beauty products are stored. You must be plum. Come in. Come in. And she's working there as a cover, but she has her own personal agenda. She's undercover working for this underground feminist organization, trying to undermine the goals of Austin Media. And she has identified Plum as a possible ally in the fight. They get us to pay them to tell us how broken we are. And then we pay for the products to fix it. I say, enough. Time to change the game. Lita is also part of the resistance. She also identifies Plum as somebody really special who needs to sort of come into the movement. Are you following me? Lita is kind of an oddball. She's found her place trying to provide comfort for others who maybe don't see themselves as normal or accepted. You have an amazing day. You're capable of that. Plum is so closed off outwardly, but I think Lita sees that there's something fierce inside there. I want you to go see someone, Verena Baptist. She will change your life. Verena Baptist, her mom started a, a weight loss clinic, and Verena shut it down and used the money to start this feminist collective. Verena brings women to Calliope House in order to activate them and bring out their voices in a powerful and potent way. What she wants for Plum is a deprogramming from beauty industry thinking to really question her ideas about what she'll gain from being a size six. Plum's never had a place where she can be accepted and that's intoxicating. Her fuse gets lit. She realizes that she has the power to do something. Anyone can see our plum has a secret rebel heart. Ooh, I just eat her up. These characters are so interesting to watch. I think it's gonna just like blow a lot of people's minds.